Anybody say nice shot? Nice shot. Hell of a shot. Or was the war in Afghanistan really about something else? Perhaps the answer was in Houston, Texas. In 1997, while George W. Bush was governor of Texas, a delegation of Taliban leaders from Afghanistan flew to Houston to meet with UNICAL executives to discuss the building of a pipeline through Afghanistan, bringing natural gas from the Caspian Sea. And who got a Caspian Sea drilling contract the same day UNICAL signed the pipeline deal? A company headed by a man named Dick Cheney, Halliburton. From the point of view of the U.S. government, this was kind of a magic pipeline um, because it could serve so many purposes. And who else stood to benefit from the pipeline? Bush's number one campaign contributor, Kenneth Lay, and the good people of Enron. Only the British press covered this trip. Then in 2001, just five and a half months before 9-11, the Bush administration welcomed a special Taliban envoy to tour the United States to help improve the image of the Taliban government. You have imprisoned the women. It's a horror, let me tell you. And I'm really sorry to your husband. He may have a very difficult time with you. Here is the Taliban official visiting our State Department to meet with U.S. officials. Why on earth would the Bush administration allow a Taliban leader to visit the United States knowing that the Taliban were harboring the man who bombed the USS Cole and our African embassies? Well, I guess 9-11 put a stop to that. When the invasion of Afghanistan was complete, we installed its new president, Hamid Karzai. Who was Hamid Karzai? He was a former advisor to UNICAL. Bush also appointed as our envoy to Afghanistan, Zalmay Khalizad, who was also a former UNICAL advisor. I guess you can probably see where this is leading. Faster than you can say black gold Texas tea, Afghanistan signed an agreement with their neighboring countries to build a pipeline through Afghanistan carrying natural gas from the Caspian Sea. Oh, and the Taliban? Well, they mostly got away. 